to have you so on. So exciting. Just tell me, where's this rod exactly? It's in here. It's here. So is it all the you way can, up? You can feel it, actually, because the rod is, is a bit stiffer than the bone, so you can feel it in there. Can it's I, all the way... I... Yeah, feel that, and you'll feel that's, that's metal bone. That's a metal rod? Yeah, all the way it... down the bone marrow so from goes, my knee to my ankle. So it goes from here? Yeah. Here down to here, yeah. Does it hurt? So I weight bear through metal now, not through my bone, so I am completely bionic. My nephews love it. They think I'm really cool because of it. Because you had a, a very nasty accident. Are we allowed to talk about that? Does yes. that mess with your head? If no, you talk I can about talk it? about it a lot. I just can't watch it. Yeah. You've, you've yet to see it back because yeah, it was I've televised. Yeah, I've yet to see it back. And, um, it was televised. It was also important for me to not watch it because I've done that, that jump 70 times perfectly once I made an accident and I didn't want to reinforce the accident in there. A lot of people do like doing that because it's gory and they show off with it but me, you know, I knew I had to come back and ski fast. I actually qualified for the Olympics in the race on that run, on the jump and that was my first race two years after I broke my leg so psychologically it was really important for me to stay strong on it.